focused a little bit on like what is asthma. Broadly speaking, uh, would be an inflammation of your airways that here in a lot of training is reversible, which is not always the case, but broadly speaking, an, an inflammation of your airways from allergenic stimuli, which is also a fairly broad term that when triggered will cause types of bronchoconstriction, which is a narrowing of the airways via muscular contraction, right? And over time, if that continues to recur, the airways will also narrow because of inflammatory reactions and eventually potentially even scarring or morphologic changes over time. Lots of talk and talk and talk and talk, right? There's a lot of things, but what else, what else kind of falls in there? Well, you've probably heard the term reactive airway disease, right? Mm -hmm. Which is not a term. And one of the things that I wish that everybody knew is to delete that term. I was um, going to say there's I, an ICD-10 code. It really should just there be is, removed. There is. And if I, if there was actually a physical manifestation of ICD-10 codes, I would be in trouble for how many times I would have been like lighting it on fire and burning it and throwing it off a cliff. 